Hi guys, it's Fashion Trend, and today I'm going to teach you how to draw Hinata from Naruto. If you don't know the show, the show Naruto, it's on Netflix, and I suggest you watch it. So anyways, let's get started. Okay, so first you're going to, we're going to start drawing the eyes. First you're going to make a little line over here. Then you're going to go like that for the eyelashes. Color it in a little over here to make it a bit darker. Next we're going to, her eyes are very big, so we're just going to put this over here. Now as you know, she has no pupils because she is from the Hugo clan and everything. Oops, made a little mistake there. See, it's okay if you make mistakes. As my art teacher always told me, art, artists fix their mistakes. So next, we're going to make, like, the eyelid. It doesn't have to be perfect. It doesn't have to be big and stuff. Just like that. Then we are going to make uh, her eyebrows. You're going to put a little dot right there. And as you go over here, make the line a little thinner because she has very thin eyebrows. There we go. This is going where, isn't it? Comment down in the section below if you are able to do, if you are able to draw it. Even if you're not able to draw it, keep practicing your art. Okay, moving on to the next stop. As we did in the other one, you're going to do the same thing. Make sure it's not as make sure it's not very close to him. To the other eye. This is what I do when I don't want to make the eyes very close. I just make it like that. I know this kind of looks like a mouth. So we're going to do the same thing that we did last time. See? Just like he not does. And we're going to shade it in. Sorry, it's hard to draw with one hand. If you become really good at art and keep practicing, you'll be able to draw with one hand too. Next, I'm going to draw the eye first this time. If you're wondering why I keep looking at that, just so I can see if I'm making it exactly like that one. Okay, since we finished this eye, then we can find a waste this. As you can see, they're the same size. For yours, it doesn't have to be the same size. Just try your best, as I keep saying. Next, we are going to draw the eyelid. Just do it exactly like the other one. Then we're going to draw the eyebrow. Remember, just draw a little teardrop like that. And if you can't make it exactly like that, if you want, you can keep looking at this one to see how it is, like I keep doing. Remember, it doesn't have to be exactly like this one. See, this one is a little darker with this one. I can change my mistake or make it look better. Okay, next we're going to make the nose. First, put a little line right there. Then, we are going to 
put another line right there to make the nose. For, you're going to do this. I know it looks like the mouth, but it's not, trust me. Then we're going to make the little smile. You don't have to make the smile too big, just do it nice and simple. Aligned and curves at the end. If, oops, I made this a little too close, but it's okay, you don't have to fix it. Next, we're going to put a line over here. Over here. If you don't know what we're doing right now, we're making the hair of Hinata. See, <laughs> it kind of looks like she's an alien now. But it won't look like that for long. When you're making the face, you want to make it like a little curve line. You see how I made mine? Just kind of a curved V, you know? Next, we are going to add, add some more stuff. This is her bangs. If you're confused on why this Hinata's order, this is from Naruto Shippenin. See over there, I messed up a little on the bangs, but we can fix everything at the end. It's looking good so far. Give yourself a pat on the back, okay? Made that a little too thick, so I'm just going to make it a little smaller. If you want, you can pause the video and, you know, fix, it, fix all your mistakes right now if you want. I'm going to do that right now. Just wait. Okay, I fixed all my mistakes. Next, we're going to... Oop, went the wrong way. Next, we are going to put this over here. If you didn't know, um, Hinata in Naruto Shippenin has very long hair. Memories bring back, memories bring back. Sorry, I blinked out for a moment to just do some things. So next, we're going to draw this over here. If you didn't know, we're also going to draw Hinata's coat. Make it a little bit long and stuff. Now we're going to do the same thing at this side. If you didn't notice, I made a little mistake with the neck over here, but that's okay. Keep going. Do it as best as you can. Make a little curve line over here. 
cooked. This is Hinata Shinobi. Shinobi headband. If you wear this in the Naruto series, that means you're a ninja. Let's see how we're doing so far. Pretty good. Now we're going to start drawing designs on this soon after we draw some more things. And now we're going to draw the sign. Guess what village he's in? If you can't. If you can, I might give you a shout out. There we go. I messed up a little on the sign, but that's okay. Remember, I'm going to fix this all at the end after this video. Next, we're going to draw more of her hair. JK. We're going to draw her shoulders now. And shoulder down, better to go. It's okay if it goes at the end of your paper, just try and make it look as good as you can. Okay, it's time for the next step. Keep following my movements. If I if I stop talking, that means I'm trying to focus. So far, so good. <laughs> Next, we're going to draw like this kind of net over here. If you're having trouble drawing her, just to type in Hinata in Google and look at a picture of her. Then you'll be able to draw her better. That's what I do sometimes with my drawings. So just keep watching this video. Keep practicing. Leave a comment and subscribe. Anyways, that's it for now, guys. Bye. Make sure you leave a comment and a like. And make sure you subscribe. I might do shoutouts. Bye.